Hello everyone. Welcome to today's tropical update. Before we start can I remind you to subscribe to the channel as it really helps and shows your support. You can also share this with your friends and family. Anyway let's begin. Today we will be talking about the chances of 93S forming into tropical cyclone Guambe. First of all here is my weather follower hazard zone forecast WFHZ for tropical cyclone Faraji. It shows the likely area to be impacted by the tropical cyclone. 93S has been bringing heavy persistent rain to Mozambique this past week. But it is slowly moving east-southeast over the Mozambique Channel. This means it will get better organized and likely form into a relatively strong cyclone. It is unclear at this stage if it will strike Mozambique again as a strong cyclone. I'll keep you up to date if anything changes. Here is the latest spaghetti plots for investigative area 93S. The models seem to be very confident at the moment, as the majority of them predict a strong cyclone forming. After about 24 hours it gets a bit uncertain with the track. You can see with the arrow I put in that a handful of the models take this storm right back into Mozambique. This could give strong winds and more unneeded heavy rain to Mozambique and some surrounding countries. A few of the other plots go just east of Mozambique keeping most of the destructive effects away from land. But it is something that needs to be determined. I'll post an update tomorrow updating you on this storm if you prefer. Here is the GFS main model forecast run for 93S. You can see that it will continue strengthening and moving generally in a southerly direction. But it does come really close to Mozambique. So impacts are likely to happen. If you have any questions, I'll be sure to answer your questions. Well that's all I have for you today. I hope you found this informative. Remember to subscribe for more tropical updates like this. I'll see you very soon in the next tropical cyclone update. Stay safe and goodbye.